Nelson Chamisa, the prominent opposition politician in Zimbabwe, has distanced himself from any political party following his resignation as the leader of the Citizens Coalition for Change CCC in January. His decision comes amidst a high court application filed by Senjizo Chibangu, the self-proclaimed interim secretary general of CCC, seeking a court order to remove alleged Chamisa allies from CCC's offices in Bulawayo. Chibanga claims that Chamisa's associates were responsible for painting the CCC Bulawayo offices blue, fueling speculation that Chamisa was forming a new political party with blue as its main color. In his affidavit, Chibanga stated, They indeed confirmed that a group of unknown people of about 25 to 30 people comprising both male and females had besieged applicants Bulawayo provincial offices situated at No. 41 Fort Street between 2nd and 3rd Avenue in Bulawayo claiming to have been sent by and furthering the interests of the respondent Chamisa, forcibly took occupation, control and possession of the applicant's offices. Chamisa, however, vehemently denied these allegations, dismissing the application as frivolous. He clarified, I am presently not with any movement, grouping, or political party emphasizing that he had not directed or encouraged anyone to occupy the CCC Bulawayo offices. Chamisa reiterated that since his resignation as CCC leader, he had not physically been to Bulawayo, making it impossible for him to be involved in the alleged occupation of the offices. Expressing his frustration, Chamisa accused Chibangu of using the courts to gain relevance and misappropriating his name and image. Interestingly, Chamisa pointed out that CCC had continued to use his face as their preferred logo, despite his resignation. He firmly stated, I wish to reiterate that I have no special association with any color, any political organization or any movement. Chamisa's response comes at a time when his followers eagerly anticipate the launch of a new opposition political party, potentially adopting blue as its color. However, the politician emphasized that he had no connection to any such party or movement, reiterating his current detachment from any political affiliations. As the legal battle unfolds, the controversy surrounding Chamisa and CCC highlights the political landscape's complexities in Zimbabwe. The case will likely shed light on the internal dynamics within opposition parties and the struggle for power in the country's challenging political environment. Oh